Hey guys, KC Jilly here. I uh, I have a, a tray full of onions that I still need to get rid of. And I've got a little uh, area below my shelf over here and that's where I'm gonna do it. Now in here, this particular section is my native soil at this time. And uh, I have poured out a bunch of vermiculite and some compost and I added a little bit of that Happy Frog all-purpose fertilizer. It is 645, okay? And I'm just gonna show y'all kinda how I'm gonna prepare this soil. We'll check it out. This is where I usually store all my vermiculite and peat moss and any kind of compost or fertilizer stuff that I have. And just below it, you see I have all this wasted space and it stays damp down there all the time. That's carrots over on that side. So I thought, why not use the, this area and put the rest of my onions down there? So I'm gonna roll this stuff in, a little bit of that happy frog, a little bit of compost, and a little bit of vermiculite into my natural soil and get it good and loose. And then I'm going to plant the rest of my onions there. So let's see what this looks like as we roll it over. So guys, this is what my native soil looks like. You know, it's, it's got some clay in it, but it's not bad dirt. No complaints, it does okay. But when I mix all this vermiculite in there, that'll give it a little bit of room to breathe and some of these roots, a little bit of room to wiggle and that other stuff's just good for it. When these onions are done, something else will go there and I'm gonna keep building this soil, but I'll bring you guys back in a minute when I get it all mixed in. Show you my next step. Okay guys, I got it all mixed up and watered in and I'll show you what it looks like. So right now it looks like a big old soupy mess, but I'll let that dry up a little bit. And then I'll take a, a leaf rake and roll it upside down where it's, where it's backwards, the tongs are sticking up in the air. And just run it through there one more little time before I get serious after it dries out some. And the end result, it kind of comes out like this. You know what I mean? The ground is, is soaked right now, so we see where it's kind of holding a little water. It's a little low there, but I'll straighten that up with a rake. But that gives me about that section right there is probably two and a half foot by five foot this little section so there ain't nothing wrong with that i can get a whole lot of them onions in there and maybe i'll have some for winter so it looks rough now i'll show you the finished product and i've sweated enough out here in this 100 degree weather at five o'clock so uh i'm going in y'all have a good evening 